going through my business emails and today's one is interesting would you sell me a pair of your panties how much for them do you like big ones I've been living in a new house for quite a while now and this is the only week where I've actually been in this room like every day making chicken tarragon today Tim if you're watching if you're here this is what you would be having for lunch oh. I made two portions of sauce, so there's a lot. I think no one complains about having too much sauce anyway. It's amazing, like Chubby never misses. Always! Ready? You can do it, baby! You never caught it before. Come on! Yes! Chubby. Amazing! <laughs> Ready? Oh, amazing! <laughs> I think Isaac just gave me my first gift. He came in, he was all happy. You know that really sweet but also kind of sinister smile he has? So yeah, he wandered in, he was really happy and I was just thinking, okay, what did you do? He was waddling over like this, really happy and I was like, what do you have there? And then he gave me something, something small and then he watered off. I examined it a little bit and I was like, this, it looks kind of slimy, kind of yellow. It was a legit piece of dried up snot <sighs> it's personal he made it himself sometimes i swear this kid is korean tim and i we are chinese and it seems like he speaks anything but cantonese so many of you guys have witnessed him call me oma a lot of times i never taught him that and then like just there in the kitchen he said bailia and bailia i think in korean is hurry up and again i don't know where it comes from he'd say shia which is Mandarin for yes, so he'll say everything but Cantonese. And then, what does the giraffe go? Gloria, I've always loved you. I stayed over at my in-laws last night. They're really sweet. I think they know that I'm, maybe I have too much pride, but I'm not the type that would ask for help. So when they're like, Lyndon, you know, you can always stay over. And before they finish, I was like, okay. Yes, I stayed over for tonight and I'm going back today. I'm really, really excited today, guys. I was on the phone with my manager and we were talking about our plans to build more schools for this year. So last year, we had a target to build two schools. Mission succeeded and this year, we're aiming to build three schools. So again, I'm just working on this year's design. This year I'm doing something totally different and I'm so excited with the idea so far and I think you guys are gonna really love it. Anyways. My in-laws are really nice and especially when it comes to my father-in-law, he's not the type that says a lot of stuff. I think he sees that when Isaac has around me, he tends to be more whiny and moany. So when he sees that I'm kind of like busy trying to get stuff done, He'll just take him away for a moment. If I'm working on something and it's like quite dull, he'll actually just open the light before he walks away. So he's like the very subtle type. He's not the type that would express himself, but he would do it through actions instead. So when I was telling Tim this, Tim was like, oh, my dad sounds just like me. We're just the same. And I was like, do you know who's just like you? Your son, because he has started to pick his nose all the time. Oh, McDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O Oh, McDonald had a farm E-I-E-I-O Okay Here's a little update on Isaac You know how he's always been a very like silent baby? He is gonna be two next month Exactly one month's time And it's only recently he really started to mimic us Like yesterday we went to see fishes And he said fish Even though he's a bit of a late bloomer um, he is making progress. What's really amazing is when I was little, all I ever did was write my own storybooks and draw. I always thought when I grew up, I'm going to be a story writer. I always wanted to be an illustrator. Now, I, it's funny how things go. Now, I, like years and years and years later, I've gone to a different path. But, you know, especially with the book that I'm working on and now I being able to design and draw for the campaign for the schools. Like, I think I just find it really 
incredible how not much has changed after all, even though a lot is different. This morning I came to the kitchen and my mom in law she does Tai Chi, so she was using this sort. It actually, I don't know how, but it actually goes all the way out. And she was like fully just, you know, like, she was just, just so fit. She was like going in a routine and then she turned around and there was me walking in. And I was like, she was like, what's wrong? And I was like, I think I pulled a muscle last night. That is when you know you're getting old, when you kind of like pull a muscle from sitting on a desk. Little guy's a bit huffy today. <laughs> the reason he's crying guys is because I shut the door and then he started crying. When I opened the door again, he cried even more. Why are you smiling like that? I didn't even touch you. Huh? 